If you want to set up Minecraft Java Edition on your Steam Deck, this is going to be the easiest way to do it. So all you want to do is make sure you're in desktop mode and then come over here to the software center and just search for Minecraft. Okay, search for this and now download this one right up here. So you just want to click install and then wait for that to install. Okay, so now that that has finished installing, you just want to click launch. Now it'll download a couple more things. So just wait for this to finish. Perfect. So now you choose your login. So if you have the Mojang account, you can log in that way. Or if you have Microsoft, log in Microsoft. I have Microsoft, so I'm going to log in here. I'm just going to sign in real quick, and then I'll start this back up. Okay, so once you log in, you should see a little thing, and then just click it. It'll say, let's go. So now you're logged in. And as you can see, Minecraft Java Edition. So something I've found that always works best is you want to click play right now. But right now, your controls won't work. So, you know, it's going to basically be unplayable. But I'll show you how to fix that in just a second. So here it's going to download the latest version. So just give it a second, let it boot up, and then exit right back out of it. Okay, so once it downloads, you'll be booted up into Minecraft, just like this. Your mouse will work. You want to turn narrator, narrator. off. Narrator. Okay. Narrator. Continue. Off. Okay, so now you can exit right out of this menu. You don't have to load up a world or anything. Okay, so now that you exited out of Minecraft, you want to open up Steam, and then click Add a Game, Add a non-Steam Game, and then you want to find that Minecraft that you just downloaded. So, here it is. You just want to click that right there. Make sure there's nothing else. Yep. Add selected program. Okay, so now you should see Minecraft show up here. There's not going to be any artwork yet because you need to add it yourself. Or use an app that'll add it for you. But you just want to test that you did add the right one. Always found it's easier to fix. So there you go. Shows right up. And you could just tap. So it might make you log in one more time. Don't do it yet. You just want to exit out of this. Okay, and now you can go into gaming mode. Now that you're back in gaming mode, it'll probably be the first icon right here, but if it's not, it'll be all the way over here in your library, and then on Steam, and then it'll be alphabetically, where is it, Minecraft. Um, okay, so here it is. There's not going to be any artwork or anything. I'm sure you guys can figure that out on your own. If not, someone in the comments can probably help you. Click play right here. And then your account should show up. If it doesn't, see, it might kick you out. Just log right back in. I'm going to log in, and then I'll pick up from there. And now you can hit play. You'll load right in. And now, as you can see, the controls do not work. So you're going to want to come back over here, go to controller settings, and then find a good community layout. <clears throat> I'm going to use this one. And then just click apply layout. Okay. So now you'll have your mouse right here. Change the scheme mode. Okay, let's make it. Okay, so once you load in, everything should work. And remember, it is Java edition. So like normally, you're not playing with a, a controller. But there are plenty of community layouts. So there's definitely one that you'll like. Like this one has gyro controls, which that's pretty cool. So yeah. Hopefully this taught you something. Let's see. Hopefully it taught you something.
I mean, not everyone knows how to do this. It is a little tricky. Now I got myself lost in a cave. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if it taught you something.